And welcome back to the Valley today. Let's take a look at our Tower Cam time lapse. Valley News Live Storm Team Sky Cam Network shot in Fargo, showing what happened yesterday. It was mostly sunny skies turning sunny, but temperatures uh, were down compared to where we were. We only saw highs getting into the mid 70s for your Tuesday. Now, with the clear skies, temperatures have cooled significantly. We're going to start off into the upper 40s and lower 50s, sunny skies throughout the day, and that gets us into the lower 80s with a light wind mainly from the north by the afternoon. At at, we're at 50 degrees right now in Fargo. Wind north around 3 miles per hour with Moorhead at 52 degrees and Grand Forks at 44 degrees with mainly clear skies. Other temperatures show we're at 48, Jamestown 50, Valley City down toward Gwinter with warmer air, low to mid 50s into Lakes Country. We are seeing temperatures ranging from the upper 40s to upper 50s into the Devil's Lake Basin, but cooler into the Northern Valley and Northwestern Minnesota as most of us into the the low to mid 40s to start off this Wednesday. We have light and variable winds uh, mainly from uh, the, uh, the south at around five, 0 to 5 miles per hour. Most everybody will flip around to more of a north or a northeasterly wind and it will stay pretty light through the afternoon. Now there are some uh, reports of some fog out there. Most of us actually pretty good right now but into northwestern Minnesota say from like the Roseau area into Thief River Falls or in between those two cities. We have the, the uh, a chance of seeing some dense fog in these areas. We'll take a look at the entire viewing area and watch for fog as we go through this morning. Now we got mostly clear skies across most of the viewing area right now. You have to make your way south of Ellendale, south of Fergus Falls into the Sisseton area before you even start to run into any clouds. High pressures in charge of our forecast giving us the light winds, but as the high works off to the east, we're going to tap into more of a southerly flow that will keep us warm to round out the week. And behind this high, we have another high pressure system, so more sunshine will last for the next few days. Here's the clear skies through the afternoon, turning sunny, and uh, we are going to see temperatures a little warmer. We're going to be at yesterday's highs by around the noon hour, so that's low to mid 70s. And uh, high temperatures today ranging from the upper 70s to lower 80s. Some clouds uh, off into our far southern counties, but again, mostly sunny skies for most of us. Temperatures falling into the mid 60s for evening plans with low temperatures starting off your Thursday, low to mid 50s. Still mostly clear skies through the day on Thursday as we do start to warm up. Up with low to mid 80s for highs on Thursday. And then for Friday, we will see mostly sunny skies once again. We're tracking our next chance of some showers and thunderstorms getting into our viewing area, say after the midnight hour on Saturday, lasting through Sunday morning. This is a chance we have to get actually some rain lasting through the day on Sunday before it moves out and gives us mostly clear skies again to start our 80s into the Southern Valley. Sunny skies, we're going to say seasonal reasonably warm with upper 70s to near 80 into lakes country with the winds light mainly from a north northeasterly direction by the afternoon at around 5 to 10 miles per hour in most places. Northwestern Minnesota upper 70s and lower 80s and lower 80s for most of us into the Devil's Lake Basin and the Northern Valley. Still plenty of sunshine as we go through the afternoon. Here's the photo of the day. It's called Overnight Light Show in Comstock, Minnesota. Thank you, Tiffany, for this one used in the background of the seven-day forecast. And recapping the next couple of days, mostly sunny skies. There's your high of 81 for today and 86 for tomorrow as we keep plenty of sunshine. Sunny skies for Friday up to 88 and 90 on Saturday with mostly sunny skies. Next chance of some showers and thunderstorms overnight Saturday, possibly lasting through the day on Sunday. Sunday at 84, but Monday at 76 and 78 for the day on Tuesday with partly cloudy skies. Looks good. Thank you, Justin. Coming up here on the Valley today, what fashion trends will have your kids making a statement at school this year?